Yo, what's good, people? Izzy Max here. Finally back. Uh, we kind of went under a hiatus. Uh, my last week of the season, it was just kind of a, a low-tier meme match from me and Matt, so we didn't, wasn't really able to uh, record it. Uh, I've been having some troubles with my recording, so hopefully I figured it all out. But uh, we are in playoffs. Uh, so the wildcard match happened. It was against uh, John and Dark. Uh, John ended up taking it away. There's no recording on it, so I don't really know how he played. But then we were able to make some transactions. Um, I picked up Vaporeon, not really for this match, and I dropped Mandibuzz. Uh, and he dropped Cradilly and picked up something. I don't remember quite off the top of my head. But him dropping Cradilly is actually huge for us. Uh, for this mon right here uh, on the screen now. So this is going to be White Herb Dracovish. And White Herb might seem kind of weird, but last time we played, he did bring Charm Meowstic. Uh, so I'm kind of expecting that again. My main max options, um, which is basically the Hallucha, does have speed control. So we're going to try to utilize that as best as we can. But if it's just a normal Dracovish, um, we are going to be boosting the speed. And with Psychic Fangs, Fishers, Rain, Leech, Life, and Super Fang, nothing too out of the ordinary. Um, no Protect, though, which is weird. I might, before the game, switch out Super Fang for Protect. Um, but I do feel like Super Fang could really help chip down those Mons um, that I usually can't hit very hard. So we'll see how that works. Uh, next up is our Blacephalon. This is Focus Sash. With Flamethrower, Shadow Ball, Protect, and Expanding Force. Um, this Mon just really hits everything super hard. Uh, nothing really wants to take a hit from this thing especially in that psychic terrain i can just start letting off uh, expanding forces because i don't believe he actually has a dark type so next up is gmax toxicity uh, this is choice scarf but sludge bomb overdrive hyper voice and volt switch nothing out of the ordinary this just kind of checks a lot of his mons like the rillaboom and the uh, mantine which i know he likes to use now so uh, next up is our Tapu Lele. This is going to be uh, Life Orb. Uh, no speed. This is going to be max HP, max special defense. Uh, Psychic, Thunderbolt, Energy Ball, and Moonblast. Um, this was AV. Um, but I, So I might end up changing it back. Um, I'm not 100% sure yet. And you'll see why here in a sec. Uh, next up is our main max option, which is this Halucha. Psychic Seed as always. Brave Bird, Close Combat, Protect, and Rock Slide. Nothing really wants to take a hit from this thing. And last time we played, uh, he was Rockberry, and I didn't bring Gigalith, which I'm not bringing again. So I might uh, see him expecting the uh, flying move again and actually run the flying berry on his Volcarona. So we're going to tech a rock move. Uh, and then lastly is AV Tangrowth. Um, the bot, surprisingly, is down. So I have to had to pivot because I don't... I didn't have a, a, a Mon that I needed, but I did have this Tangrowth. Uh, Leaf Storm, Knock Off, Power Whip, and Poison Jab. Uh, this thing might actually max, and it might actually do pretty good work. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to use this thing. I believe it's, yeah, max HP, max Spadef. So we're not boosting anything, but we are going to put out a uh, good amount of damage while recovering a lot. And we are Chlorophyll, just in case he does max um, the Volcarona and set the sun. So, that's kind of what we got here. Um, there might be some changes before the match. I still got about 30 minutes. Um, so, without further ado, y'all, I'll uh, see you in the game. All right, so we are in the game now. Um, I did change a couple of things. The AV did go back on the uh, Lele. And I switched out Tangrowth for the Flygon. So let's see what he has. He does have the Kangaskhan, does have the Meowstic, which is what I was thinking. Also brought kind of an off trick mode, no Regirock and no Rillaboom. So that's all good. So let's actually go, what do I wanna lead here? I think I actually just wanna lead the Flygon. So let's lead Flygon. Um, oh, also no Volcarona. Okay. 
So let's lead Flygon, Flygon Blacephalon with Tapu Lele. And I think Vish in the back. Hawlucha does look really, really good though. Probably not gonna max it. So yeah, let's go Draco Vish. I really hope the bot being down doesn't screw me, but these are the mons I had, so this is what we're gonna work with. Um, I know Johnny doesn't use a bot, which is insane, because we both have the same jobs. I know uh, the time commitment. <laughs> so we're gonna kinda see how this goes. Hopefully we can uh, squeak out a win and move on to playoffs. Um, if not, losing to Johnny isn't the worst thing in the world. So let's see what his lead is here. Okay. I don't know. Uh, okay, Kangaskhan Meow Stick. Okay. Do I still want a first impression? Or do I just want to go for the Max Dragon? Honestly, I kind of want to go for the Max Dragon here. And then just Shadow Ball. I need to get that thing off the field. Hopefully he wasn't expecting the Flygon. Um, if he has Ice Punch, I'm kind of screwed. But my team's not overly weak to Ice. Um, I mean, I have the Halucha, I guess. We are on battle tower rules because the bot was down, so I had to use some Pokemon from home, um, and they're not battle trained yet, or whatever the thing is where you switch their uh, symbol. But everything's legal. I'm not a cheater. So we are gonna max the Flygon here. Hopefully this is the right play. I have a lot of faith in this Flygon this week. That means he didn't max the Kangaskhan? Scrappy. There's no... Okay, he is. I was about to say, there's no way he fakes out the Blacephalon, because that thing could have easily maxed this turn. So I'll have to see what he does here. By the way, if you hear my AC or something, or me kind of rattling around, it is super cold in here, so I'm kind of shaky. Rain dance? Why are you setting up a rain dance? Okay, you got to be focused, Sash. Well, actually, maybe not. You do have other mons. Okay, it's not. So, down goes that. What were you expecting? Maybe like a mind blown? I don't really know, but here's the warm wind. How much is this going to do? I mean, it did a decent chunk. So, I'm okay with that. What are you going to go for, though? Okay, you do have the max ice. That is what I was kind of worried about. So you did tech Ice Punch. We are able to live it because of the drop. But then you just get rid of your rain. There goes my Focus Sash. So he's not going to know that I am Focus Sash, which is good. And it wasn't Life Orb, I don't believe. Unless I missed it. You're gonna max the Kangaskhan. So, okay. Kinda just going over some plays here. I wish I would've put that weakness policy on the Flygon. I almost did. Um, I didn't think it would live a, an Ice Punch from this thing though, not gonna lie. He might think I'm Scarf. On the Blacephalon. What does he go out to here? Right, what is this? Okay, he does go out into the Hitmon Lee. So, let's see here. Okay. I think I just want to go for the Wormwind again. Here. Actually, 
Actually, actually, maybe, maybe. I'm going to switch out the Flygon. Then just go for an Expanding Force. Kind of like that play. So let's see if this is going to work. This is risky. So there's the Surge. Are you the Surge Berry? Or Surge Seed? You are. That sucks. Oh, but you're just going to go for coaching. Oh. Oh. Boop. Well, then that was a good play. There's another boost. Are you going into me? Okay, you are. It's fine. And then you... Seeing that I wasn't... Um, he doesn't know I'm not Focus Ash, so that's good. Buffeted by the hail. Yep. Okay. Is it comfy? I don't think it would be. But it potentially is. To where two vicious wrens just kind of clean it here. If it's Doug Trio, I fish just run the Doug Trio. Actually, do I fish just run the Doug Trio? I think I do. He might be AV, seeing how much damage that actually did. I don't know yet. Sleepy? It is the comfy. Ugh, that sucks. Okay, so we are in Psychic Terrain problem is I'm not faster so I think I have to put this into the compe and then go for the vicious rend into the Kangas Khan it does put me kind of in a bad spot though that's kind of, that's what I have to do I have to do it So I kind of wish I didn't switch there now, seeing that he just earthquaked, because uh, I would have been able to kind of take it out here. Okay, I think this is still going to kill. I mean, he has that plus one defense. Uh, not quite. Okay. He does go for the warm wind. All right. That sucks. So that switch is actually coming to bite me in the butt. Ah, uh, the crit didn't matter. How much is this doing? A good amount. Leftovers. Okay. Now, if you're draining Kiss, you'll actually be able to do a lot. And because of the terrain, I can't first impression. So I have to kind of do the same thing here. And then go for the rock slide. And pray I don't miss. I put myself in a real bad position here. That max quake was crazy. Because I could have killed both Mons if I would have just expanding force raw into the uh, Hitmon Lee. And he couldn't have. Well, he's probably. No, we've seen Barry, so he's not choiced. Um, so I do have that info going into game two. Because I'm pretty sure it would have just straight up killed. Even without the, the psychic boost. 
because it does boost the special defense with the seed. Okay. Kill that. Okay. Whew. What are you going to go for here? Dazzle? Oh, you're just straight up attacking. Okay. So he has no speed in the... Uh, Kumfei. Alright, so there's game one. Came out of that one. That was tight. That was really tight. I feel like I can play better, though. So that does give me some confidence going into the next one. Always fun playing Johnny. Always a blast. So, he's decently slow on a lot of what he has. I don't think he's going to go out into... Um, whatever it's called. Hmm. Do I just do the same thing? No, because that max didn't actually do enough. So let's... I don't want to lead the Lele. I kind of like the lead that I had. With the Flygon. What if I do... What if I do... Flygon Lucha? I'm just gonna do this with Lele. I really like the flag on there. The flag on was putting in a lot of work. I'm actually gonna bring Lucha instead, though, for a late game max option. He probably doesn't think that I'm weakness policy on the whole Lucha because last time we played, I was, but I had the mime. Um, but I went away from the mime this time. So let's see if he leads the same. No. So what is this? Okay. So this is actually decently okay, I think. So I'm just going to... What am I going to do? can't be switched out. So let's fish this rend here and just shadow ball here, I think. Let's flamethrower here just in case. Yeah. Okay, there's the fish this rend. It going to do a lot. Okay, 50. That was kind of what I was worried about. <clears throat> oh, we got round strats. All right. Now that doesn't kill, does it? Holy shoot, it does. That's insane. Okay, well, honestly, that's fine. Because here, have a flamethrower. That is why it's fine. Um, yeah, I don't know what you do now. Because I'm going to Moonblast and expanding force because you really can't I'm AV he did bring the round strat that is cool that's awesome he did take out my hardest hitting mod I didn't think that would actually kill but that's insane I don't know what the targeting is so I don't know if he actually got lucky
hopefully we live this one. AV coming in clutch. So there's the expanding force. We're probably going to take out both. Yeah. And I don't get two beast boosts, which is kind of sucky. But I haven't maxed yet, so I'm probably maxing Blacephalon. Yeah. So there's Healer. And then what was Sleepy? Okay. I think I just double into the drop defense it does so yeah I'm gonna double into this if you ally switch good on you I don't think you will uh, and you're probably taking out Lele here Then I'm gonna move before um, Kangaskhan. So we'll kind of see how this goes. Good game. Okay, so there's the Phantasm. I don't think this is gonna kill. I am at plus one though. Oh, it does. Okay, so I think this is GG think down goes the comfy now I'm at plus two Blacephalon kind of the unsung hero here there's the quake okay doesn't even knock me to sash that's insane you are gonna get that plus one spadef boost though and there's the psychic doing good damage uh, that doesn't matter oh that does matter Um, so I just kind of nullified his defense boost there. Um, so I'm actually going to max guard here. Yeah, because at the very least he has to take a turn to kill uh, Blacephalon. Okay, so he's going to quake the Lele. That's okay with me. Because he's only boosting boosting his spadef, and I've already lowered his defense by one. So now he's at plus one spadef. Okay, so let's go here like this. And just rock off a close combat and a flare, probably. Stab. Like it is boosted 0 0.3.5. I think the flare is gonna do more. I could be way wrong. Okay, there's the flare. Boom, 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 boom. And this is gonna set the oh my god, was that a crit? Or is that just how much Blacephalon does? Alright, that's GG. That's insane. Alright, so we do make it into the second round where we will play Ryan. Um, so that's going to be another good one. He did end up dropping the Blaziken for the Azumarill. So that's a super good pickup for him. Um, but with that being said, GG to Johnny. Always fun to play him. Um, but without further ado, y'all, uh, we'll see you in the next round. So peace.